Hello guys and welcome to the gaming news for the 17th of October 2021. So Epic Games are going to be allowing NFT games or blockchain technology games onto their platform, which is a response to yesterday's ban from Steam. So Tim Sweeney, who is the co-founder and head of Epic Games, tweeted out saying, Epic Games Store will welcome games that make use of blockchain tech, provided that they follow the relevant laws. Disclose their terms and are age rated by an appropriate group. Uh, though Epic's not using crypto on our games, we welcome innovation in the areas of technology and finance. So, yeah. So, and like I said, I've not played any games that feature NFT or blockchain or crypto technology, but, but cool, you know, whatever. <laughs> um, the next bit of news for today is PlayStation have added a new game real to the top of their PlayStation store which to be honest I was surprised wasn't there before so uh, Shuhei Yoshida who is one of the biggest people at PlayStation tweeted out saying that PlayStation store on PlayStation 5 now has new game strand on top uh, page making it super easy to find newly released games so yeah so cool so if you're just curious what is new on PlayStation 5 it's now at the top of the store and you can browse through the new releases and then uh, this week's shout out is going to go to my friend Jesus Hears Toast. So he is the blood god. He is so many words that, you know, you can't describe how amazing he is. And he is primarily known for speedrunning Bloodborne, but he also speedruns Sekiro and all of the Souls-like games, Demon Souls and so on. And he also was featured at uh, Games Done Quick. That's how I became aware of him. And yeah, and overall, he's just a really, really nice guy. He's really nice. So I would really recommend Jesus Hears Toast and go check him out. If you do go to see him from, from here, then be sure to say that I sent you. So anyway, guys, that's it for the gaming news for today. Thank you so much for all the new followers coming onto the feed. And I will see you tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.